babe. I'm an ambitious girl. You're just small time. Liberty City is in shock today as the police and emergency services deal with the aftermath of a devastating attack on a police convoy this morning. As yet, no details have been released about the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward, when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarters databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. Come on! Señor Dickhead, it's no problem to kill you. You're gonna be sorry. Aye, aye, get lost. <laughs> Tommy Vassetti? Ha! <laughs> Shit! Didn't think they'd ever let him out. He kept his head down. Helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? We treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town, okay? We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell, even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, Sonny. None of the families will touch that shit. Time to change it. The families can't keep the backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we send someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice, quiet slice, okay? Who's our contact down there? Ken Rosenberg. Schmuck of a lawyer. How's he gonna hold Vassetti's leash? We don't need him to. We just set him loose in Vice City. We give him a little cash to get started, okay? Give it a few months, then we go down. Pay him a little visit, right? See how he's doing. Hey, hey, guys, it's uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey, hey, great, hey. Well, uh, I'm going to drive you guys to the meet, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So, uh, if all goes well, we should uh, be doing very nice to ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so, they're brothers, okay? One operates the, uh, the business, and the other one does the flying. Got it? 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s. Used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! Come on, get out of here! Ah!
Come on. Nico, what are you doing? Dave is not coming. Ah, ignore him. Come on, we got to get this thing ready before we dock. Let's go. Here, pass me that. Oh, yeah. There she is. Liberty City. Yeah. You ever been? No. Crazy place, Nico. <laughs> what you going to do? I might come back on board, or I might try to make a go of it. Like they say, it is the land of opportunity. I always wanted to make it big, on a nice place, get a dog, a house, live the dream. Like my cousin. Oh, yeah? Yes, he's got the love. House, women, cars, parties. Uh, he writes me in these wild emails, and after I got into trouble, I thought maybe, uh... Then I got this gig, and I spent the next seven months with you fine people, and I forget. <laughs> After the war finished, I couldn't get a job. Nobody could. Uh, so I uh, did some dumb things, got involved with some idiots. Ah, we all do dumb things. That's what makes us human. Could be. Okay. 